Y'all, Cat Williams is on a roll right now because he is back to spilling some wild tea about y'all's favorite celebs. And it looks like he has his eyes set on Steve Harvey and he is exposing Steve for all sorts of wild things. From stealing from him to out his daughter Lori Harvey for fame and clout. Y'all, Cat is not here to play with Steve because the tea that he's spilling is next level. Now, if y'all know Cat, then you already know that he isn't exactly Steve Harvey's number one fan. Cat is not the type to mess around or mince words, and he has made it super clear over the years that he doesn't like Steve because he thinks that Steve is a fake who steals his jokes from other comedians and then tries to pass off the jokes as his. Cat has been saying this for years, but he really dived into the matter a couple of days ago in an interview that he did with Club Shay Shay and boy did he have a lot of tea to spill. He started off by talking about how Steve would come to his shows for the sole purpose of stealing his jokes. Teen, you how Steve has always talked about a time in his life when he was broke and living in his car. Well according to Kat this was a big fat lie because there was never a time when Steve was broke. Like not only did Steve steal Kat's jokes but he also stole his entire life story which is just wild. He went on and on about Steve and you could tell that he was really hurt and upset and he has been that way for a while now. But what really got our attention was when Kat claimed that Steve has allegedly been p***ing Lori out for fame. Y'all know how Lori has something of a reputation for dating a lot of men in the industry. Well, according to Kat, Steve has set her up to be something of a girlfriend for hire in the industry, especially toward men like Diddy. For those who don't know, Lori had this weird relationship with Diddy back in 2019 and it got people talking for all the wrong reasons. First, there's the fact that there is a massive age difference between them. At the time, Lori was only 22 when Diddy was already 50. Girl, how did that relationship even happen? What did they even talk about in that relationship? It got even weirder when y'all realized that Diddy already had a five-year-old son when Lori was born. It was creepy on so many levels and it got worse when we realized that Diddy had been a part of Lori's life since she was a teenager. Diddy and Steve had been in the same circles so he met Lori after Steve got married to Marjorie but somehow he thought it was okay to pursue her romantically? After Lori and Diddy went public with their relationship, people were expecting Steve and Marjorie to kick against their relationship for obvious reasons. But they didn't. And get this, it's not like they were unaware of the relationship because Lori and Diddy were everywhere with their PDA. Well, it wasn't long before we found out that not only were Steve and Marjorie aware of the relationship, but they were also fully in support of it. Diddy once took them on vacation with him and Lori where the PDA was in full display. So yeah, they were in support of their 22 year old daughter dating a man in his 50s. But according to Kat, not only was Steve in support of the relationship, but Steve actually set up the relationship in the first place. Kat claimed that Steve out Lori to Diddy because he wanted to set Lori up in the industry. It was also at the point where Steve wasn't as hot in the industry anymore so he decided to use Lori as a stepping stone to make himself even bigger and give the Harvey name a boost in the industry. One thing about Cat is that he doesn't tell lies. He might tell a joke but he will never tell a lie and his revelations about Steve and Lori have fans shook AF and this is what they had to say. Yes Steve and Marjorie her out. Steve didn't care Lori is not his flesh and blood. Steve honestly was trying to get all the dirt on Diddy that he could get. No real father would have allowed it. Either Steve doesn't have a say or he's all about material things and status. He probably thought that a job or marriage would come out of that since she's not A-list. No sane parent would let their child who's barely an adult date a dangerous 50 year old man like him. And Diddy is crazy. He dated someone who dated his son and Steve approves of that is creepy as fudge. Yeah this is hella messy but let me know what you think about this drama and then check out this next video.